Now, if your kids have the first day jitters heading back to school this morning, we found some teachers who say they are not alone. <laughs> Denver 7's Connor Wiss takes us inside a first year classrooms, teacher's classroom to share why your student may be turning to screens more than textbooks this school year. It's time to wake up those lockers from summer vacation because it is the first day of school here at Gateway High School. For some students, it'll be their very first day here on campus. And for some teachers, it's their first day too. I wanted to be a firefighter, uh, jet pilot, ninja, cartoon star. For Stephen Aldrich. And then you grow up and then you realize, oh man, like it's where all the other jobs come from. <laughs> Deep down, so. he always knew he wanted to become a teacher. I love it. I wouldn't, I wish I would have started 10 years ago. <laughs> Today, he'll walk into this Gateway High School classroom as Mr. Aldrich with new students and a new opportunity. If you connect with them right, like you are you are their Wikipedia and it's amazing because they'll spend just as much time with you as, as parents like to think that kids spend on their phones or listening to music. Aurora Public School students will spend more time on these Google Chromebooks, making the connection between students and their teacher just a few clicks away from home. For them always being on laptops and cell phones and other gadgets, this is probably pretty user friendly for them. Mm -hmm. It's like Facebook uh, for students, but it's entirely designed to be educational. Uh, I can post homework assignments in there. Students can pull it up from anywhere. Schoology actually has a cell phone app. Literally, I can kind of teach from a distance. And at the same time, it helps us out because you know it, we become a paperless classroom, which cuts down on recycling, uh, material costs. In Aurora, Connor Wist, Denver 7. Now tomorrow we will continue our back to school series with a look at the bus driver shortage, why fewer people are hopping behind the wheel and what you can expect to make when you start. That's tomorrow right here at 6 o'clock.